Welcome back everyone. It is a tier 8 game on Melanovka. I am in my tier 7 KV-13. I am platooned with Skazzy and his Comet and Malrig in his T-43. And although it is... Although it is indeed Melanovka, there is only one artillery in the enemy team at tier 6. It makes 13 F3. So we're going to this hoping for a good fight even though we are a little bit out of tier. But there's not a huge number of tier 8s on the team. There's only 4. Uh, so we are going to head up sorry we're going to head up towards that even though the only one with any gun depression is Skaz and his Comet we've got this one IS-3 coming along most of the rest of the team is chilling on the base uh, not really doing too much to help us there is an ELC and a Carnarvon who are going to be moving up into sort of the, the lower side of uh, the right flank right here you know E-25 he could be a problem later but he's not an issue for us yet and now we're just doing the long climb up this hill. Uh, hopefully, uh, because we're mediums, we'll get up there first. We'll be able to establish a, a strong position uh, from which we and this IS-3 can assault the other team, sort of the idea. So, KV-13 is kind of a weird medium tank. It's almost as well armored as some heavy tanks. So it actually makes a halfway decent assault tank, but it's not actually a true heavy tank. It doesn't have the hit points, doesn't have the full on armor. It also comes with the standard Soviet 85mm at tier 7, which is an okay gun in pretty much every respect, but not really a, a great gun. Uh, often lacks in penetration, which is, is probably its biggest problem. It does have an impressive rate of fire and decent damage. And oh, here we are, here at the top of the hill, and. Uh, Mal right there has spotted that there's a Centurion 1, a tier 8 medium down there opposite of us. So I come up here to a side scrape position, because this tank does have decent side armor, it might actually bounce things from here. Scaz on the outside, and we're, we decide we're just going to skirmish a little bit with these mediums while waiting for our IS-3 to catch up. He's the big tier 8 heavy tank. He's the one who should be going in the front and taking the, uh, the risks for damage at first. Now it actually pulls off an impressive shot on the Indian Panzer. Shooting at a hull down Centurion. No, that's that's not going to happen. So now we're just chilling, waiting patiently. That's why I see the IS-3 is going forward. And I go, yes, the IS-3 knows his job. And I follow him in. And I tell him, come on guys, just follow us in. We're, we're going we're gonna to mess these two guys up good. There we go, IS-3 crest first, gets a good hit in, aim at the Indian Panzer, hit the Centurion, it's okay, I damaged him, I'll take it. Another one, the Indian Panzer, IS-3 is just going completely into the Centurion, I decided to get this Indian Panzer's attention, make him busy. That's when my two buddies come in and we decide to all shoot at the Centurion. Centurion goes down, switches to the Indian Panzer. For any advantage, does not know where to point his gun. There's just too many things shooting at him. Alright, with them down, spot. Oh gosh, Type 5-9. the best player on the other team. Tell the guys, quick, quick, focus the Type 5-9. Ooh, take a brutal hit from the artillery. Uh, hold on, Type 5-9. I'm gonna have a hard time damaging him. Luckily, he shoots the ground. I don't even know how. And once, uh,. Once I'm free, I immediately charge. We're going to do a medium swarming assault. So I tell you guys, go on, just, just keep focusing on that Type 5-9 and do not stop moving. Oof, hit taken. KV-13 can take it. Just going all out in the hard to hit department here. Yep, I'm using gold. We get too a little confused. Thonk, we all kind of run into each other right here. Unfortunately, because of this, Mallory ends up having to charge headlong into the enemy team and is taken out. Oof, get tracked by the VK3601H, decide I'm not really interested in uh, staying there, so I free myself. First on the back of the ridge line here to gain some momentum. Seeing that Skazzy is focusing on the Black Prince, I also start focusing on the Black Prince. I'm okay with Sheen Gold, the Black Prince, that's a big, scary, heavy tank. Get him out. 
Once again, we run into each other. This time around, I'm tracked and I can't get free, but that's okay. This VK is the last thing left alive on his team. And I managed to get the killing shot. That's the power of mediums wolf packing. The, uh, the, the crazy, I guess we'll call it the crazy stirring action of three medium tanks racing through the enemy team. Uh, had them so perplexed that the rest of my team was able to shoot at them relatively uns uh, unnoticed. And they pushed through to uh, take the enemy team from the other side. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed watching that match. Good game, and good night.